Hi, this is your Phoenix, back to another energy update for the sign of Scorpio. Just keep in mind, these are general readings, they're not going to resonate for all of you. But for the ones that it does resonate for, please like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. For those of you interested in a personal reading with me, all the information is in the description box below. This is going to be for the Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs of Scorpio. So let's jump into this reading and see what is coming to for you guys. Okay, so it would seem someone wants a romantic connection with you or you want a connection with somebody else. But you have gone through a lot of failed relationships in the past that have you feeling like it's not something for you anymore. But this relationship is going to come to you very quickly and there is going to be a new beginning happening for you that is going to definitely blow your mind. It's going to happen so quickly, you're not even going to be able to recognize it until it turns into an actual relationship. So it is something that is definitely going to take you by storm. It's going to be a, a type of whirlwind romance. It's going to feel very dreamy for a little while. But it is a new beginning and a new relationship that does want to come in for you. All right. You could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra or Aquarius or you could have this in your chart. But somebody definitely knows what it is they want now. And they are definitely going to cut out what is not serving them. And for some of you, you may find it difficult to want a relationship or a long-term commitment with anyone. Because you have gone through so many failed connections in the past. And it has never really served you the way you wanted to. You've always been heartbroken. But this person that is coming in will directly let you know that it is a commitment and a long-term relationship that they are looking for. They're going to show you with their actions that they are very serious. So some of you, this person that is coming in does actually state to you from the beginning that they are not looking for a casual hookup, they are looking for a relationship. Could be a Capricorn some of you are dealing with, but this person is not the toxic type. This person doesn't have any underlining um, deceitfulness about them. And it is going to cause you a lot of stress, worry, and anxiety because you're going to feel that is the way this person is coming at you. Another person that is lying to you and deceiving you, no, this person doesn't isn't doing that, wouldn't be doing that. Because they have been looking at you for a while and they know that you have been through a lot of stuff. They know that you have had your ups and downs and things have not always played out for you in a righteous way. So it is the reason why this person is coming towards you directly and letting you know they want a long-term relationship with you. They're not going to hide anything from you. They're not going to lie to you. They're not going to play any games with you. So this person that is coming towards you is a very direct communicator because they definitely want a new beginning with you. They want growth in the relationship and they want to have a new start with you. Could be an Aries for some of you, but this person knows how to take charge of a situation. This person knows what it is they want and they know how to get it. <clears throat> but you have been waiting for your ships to come in for a while. So don't be surprised when this comes in. Don't be surprised with this person's bluntness or directness to you. 
because it is going to be a wonderful connection it is spiritually guided and it is a relationship that will cause some healing for you in your life so where others may have wronged you this person is going to help you heal and be able to trust again all right so don't be defensive against this person let this person in all right because you're going to still be in a stalemate you're going to be stuck between your past and what is happening so quickly in this relationship hmm. yeah this person sees you as everything that they have been ever wanting this person sees you as someone that is strong, someone that they can build with, someone that they can grow with, someone that they definitely want to have a connection with and hold on to. Yeah. So they're going to wait. They're going to be in a rush because they're going to want to stick around you all the time but they know that there is a balance that you need in your life and they are going to supply you with it they are going to be everything that you have been wanting in every previous relationship there is going to be a healing and a restoration for you in this connection so where other people may have hurt you this person is going to help you restore that balance in your life where you can trust again where you can open up yourself to anyone or someone yeah because this person wants to build with you this person wants to grow with you this person wants a commitment with you this person wants to take a chance on this relationship see where it will go but what they have in their mind is a long-term commitment with you yeah they're not about games they're not about casual sexual hookups they're not about wanting to run after the next person that passes their way they are ready for a long-term commitment with you but you have to decide what it is you want you have to decide if you're going to let this person in or you're going to keep living in the regrets of your past but you have the choice to make yeah so you could try to find balance in a situation and give this person an equal and fair chance or you could treat them the way other people have treat you because you're not going to see them as your nine of cups they probably look different to what it is you are accustomed to but give this person a chance because their heart seems to be pure gold this person wants to have a romance with you they want to have a commitment with you they want to take charge of the situation. They want long-term success with you. Because the wheel is moving in your favor this time around. Things will work out for you. It is the right time and the right person to have a long-term relationship with. For some of you, it could be a Sagittarius. <laughs> This ending was devastating. The relationship that you just got out of, the pain, the hurt, it was all transforming you to make you ready for this relationship that was coming in. Mm -hmm. You're a perfectly matched pair. Could be an Aries, Leo, or Sag you're dealing with. But Scorpio, you are the one that don't know what it is you want. And you are the one trying to control a situation. Because this person is going to come into you already knowing what it is they want. They want you you are the one that is going to be doubting and worrying and frustrating yourself because you're afraid to trust again you're afraid to love again you're afraid to open yourself up to anyone or to any relationship because of someone that hurt you in the past because of an ending that tore you to pieces yes i do understand your fear but this person is not going to do that to you this person is going to directly communicate to you that you are the one that they want. Are you going to accept the challenge to become what this person wants? Or you're going to remain that broken person that the other person left behind? The choice is yours to make. At the end of the day, you have to make the choice. Do you want to fix yourself and have a relationship of a lifetime? Or are you going to let 
practice pass you by. The choice definitely is yours. You have to know what it is you want. And I guess for most of you, wanting a loving, committed relationship is something that you have been wanting for some time. Let this person in. Yes, your heart is broken. Yes, your mind is torn apart. But love you and give this person a chance. Because this person isn't coming in to play games. They're coming in for long-term commitment. They don't see you as a toy. They see you as wife or husband material. They see you as someone that they can love and cherish and grow with that could be the mother or father of their children. You go first, the universe will catch up. So take that leap of faith on this person because they want to take a leap of faith with you. And you will realize that everything will work out for your betterment. Trust your part. If you knew you would, you were supported, what would you do? The, the universe is sending you this message to prepare you for this person that is coming towards you. And they're also letting you know that this is a divine connection that they are sending to you. All right, so allow it. Let it in. All right, so this is what I have for you guys. I hope it helps. Have a good one.